Today we're going to show you how to change the door closure bearing on your refrigerator. It's a pretty easy job, only need a few tools. A 3 8 ratchet or a 3 8 wrench, Phillips screwdriver, and a small flat blade screwdriver. Let me show you how it's done. To do this repair, we are going to have to remove the fresh food door from the refrigerator. Now, a couple things we'll have to do is remove all of the bins and any food items that are on the refrigerator door, take those out of there, and then turn off both the freezer and the fresh food controls because the door will be removed for the length of time that it takes to do the repair. Now the first step we need to do is remove the hinge cap with a single Phillips screw at the rear of the cover. Just remove that, lift the hinge cover off, and that will expose the two 3 8 bolts that hold the top hinge to the cabinet. Remove those two bolts. Now just lift the hinge out of the door and now we're ready to take the door off and put it on a flat surface where we can work on it. Just open the door, lift straight up and put it on a flat work surface. Now that we have the door on a suitable work surface, you note the location of the door closer. It sits inside of the door stop bracket and on the perimeter of that door bearing, there's three little slots that will accept a small flat blade screwdriver. Simply just insert it into each of those sequentially and pry the bearing out of the housing. Take our new bearing, it's triangular in shape. Just line it up, press it into place. ready to reinstall the door. Before we reinstall the door, we should take time to inspect the lower hinge closer bearing and the actual hinge pin itself. Make sure that there's no cracks in the bearing and clean up any dirt or debris that may be on that hinge pin. And at that point, you may want to add a little bit of uh, food grade grease or Vaseline, just a small amount on the hinge pin itself and on the bearing, just to make it close a little easier. Now we're ready to reinstall the door. Now we're ready to reinstall the door. Simply line up the hinge pocket with the hinge pin. Rotate the door into place. The gasket should hold it firmly there, but just keep a hand on it to make sure. Reinstall the top hinge, and if needed, clean this hinge pin up, put a little lubricant on it. Reinstall the two 3 8 bolts. We won't tighten them up yet until we have the door lined up. Make sure the gap between the two doors is even from top to bottom, and that the top of the door is even with the cabinet. Tighten them into place. Now we're ready to reinstall the hinge cover. Reinstall the Phillips screw. Check the operation of the door. Now we're ready to reinstall all the shelves and don't forget to turn the refrigerator back on.